Hello, my name is Ian. Today I'm going to be testing out my 3D printed end for my Auto 5. Currently it is set up for light loads internally and it is equipped with a short spare barrel. And the whole pat the whole point of this test is to test the impact resistance of this end for cycling purposes. And it has a flashlight on it to just see if this Picatinny rail is able to hold up to various recoil. Today I'm going to be testing bird shot, heavy bird shot, and I'm going to be testing some slugs. And that should be all for the testing today. Got three rounds of light target shot. They all function just fine. Yep, heavy target load function just as it should. Horn still feels like it's intact. Last test, we got slugs. These should be a little bit less power than the uh, game load bird shot I just fired. So this should work just fine. Yep, all those cycled. Forearm is still on there tight. I don't feel any cracking. Flashlight's still on there. Let's say this is a win. I've got my forend here, and it's made out of PLA Plus. And one of the main things I had to do for fitting was I had to dremel down this lip that inserts into the uh, receiver. That's what the wooden hand guards usually have a failure is, is the plywood that is inserted here in a little ring is usually cracked from the forearms not being tightened down enough. That's what will usually result in the wood splitting down the middle on the bottom and the back end. And in the front, where the wood will usually split, because the barrel uh, impacts this area, it will usually split down the middle, and there's very little impact damage from this firing those slugs and the heavy target load. My detent still ready, retained, and it's not letting fly out. And that's just, again, a little polished roofing nail that I rounded down with some sandpaper and some files, and that works just fine. And my old Picatinny rail that is also printed into this, held on, and this isn't a 100% infill. This is seven walls with 30% infill in a cubic subdivision. So this is still a hollow part. But yeah, that's my little invention. I'll be releasing the files and I'll let you guys be able to have your various Auto 5s work again.